I'm Mike, N2MAK, and I'm at the Erie Canalway National Heritage Corridor in Western New York. Gonna do a Parks on the Air activation using the Rybakoff antenna. But for the first time, I'm gonna run it using the full 100 watts. All right, let's take a quick look at the setup here. So the Rybakoff uses a 25 foot radiating element. That's going up the 33 foot MFJ mast. And then I have for radials, six 17 foot uh, radials going off in different directions. They're marked with cones. All the wires are connected in to the LDG four to one unun. And I'm using a bongo tie to secure that to the mast. Then I got a short jumper of coax going down to the LDG one to one choke. And then I got about 15 feet of coax uh, going from the choke to the LDG tuner. And then that's connected to the ICOM 7300. It'll let us run the full 100 watts with the Rybakoff. This is the LDG AT1000 Pro 2 Auto Tuner. It's good for up to 1000 watts. Do I need that? Absolutely not, but I could not pass it up for the price I got it for at my club's auction uh, earlier this month. All right, we are calling CQ Poda on 30 meter FT8. Uh, no ALC, SWR is about 1.3. We got our first 30 meter FT8 contact already. All right, we're giving uh, FT8 a shot on six meters. You can see uh, no ALC, SWR is around 1.2. Um, I've been calling for a little bit and haven't had any luck. I'm not seeing any activity, but you don't know unless you try. CQ POTA, CQ POTA, CQ POTA. This is November 2, Mike Alpha Kilo calling CQ for Parks on the Air. Standing by for any stations anywhere. Kilo, Bravo Heat, Uniform, Foxtrot, Papa. New York, 5-9, Florida, 5-9. Uh, it's Whiskey Delta 3, November Alpha, WD3, NA. Uh, thank you. Uh, I've got you at 5959 five, when the tuner's not going. <laughs> I'm in Kilo 0552, five, Kilo 0552. Five, 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 QSL, you're 52 North Texas, 52 North Texas. Whiskey 5, X-ray Norway. QSL, you're 59, true 59, Mississippi. Name is Randy. Alpha Echo 4, Juliet Charlie. USL, Mike. Hey, this is Matthew down in Alabama. I'm also in a Poda Park. I'm in Kilo 3711. Over. Whiskey, Italy, 6, November Golf. QSL, QSL, I have you 555, five, 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 Charlie, Alpha, Charlie, Alpha. QSL, the 52 New York. I am QRP, QRP, 5 Whiskey. Equal, Fatu, Echo, Victor, Mike. Equal, Fatu, Echo, Victor, Mike. Equal, Fatu, Echo, Victor, Mike. QSL, Mike. QSL, November 2, Mike, Alpha, Kilo. November 2, Mike, Alpha, Kilo. Estados Unidos, QSL. The lights on the tuner totally remind me of Knight Rider. I, I, I can't be the only one. Kilo, Golf 2, Mike, Mike. Yeah, Roger, good to get you also, Mike. Uh, you're sounding you're sounding about a 5.7, 57 on a meter 5.5. Five. So I'll give you the 57 there, Roger. Okay, I got a 5 up there, November 4th, Mike out tequila. Let's start with you. Good evening, good afternoon, Mike, how are you? Roger, the 6532, and you're a nice 5.9. <laughs> are you too happy today? Uh, negative. Nope. I I I purchased a a new tuner recently, and I'm I'm trying out the Rybakoff antenna with the full 100 watts for the uh, first time. November 4, Echo, Sierra Uniform. Roger, Mike, I got you 5-7, New York City. That was fun. Got the park activated. We got 40 contacts on seven different bands. Started off on 30 meters, got a couple contacts on FT8 there, and then switched to voice and did SSB first on 10 meters, then 12, 
15, 17, 20, and finished up on 40. Um, I did try six meters, both voice and FT8. I didn't have any luck. The band didn't seem open. I'm not surprised. Uh, but all in all, I've, I've had good luck uh, with the Rybakov from 10 uh, meters on to uh, 40 meters. That seemed to be the case today. But it was fun being able to do the full 100 watts. The, uh, the new LDG tuner worked great. Uh, took a little getting used to it. I had to read the manual. This was my first time using it. But I was able to get a good match, usually 1.5 or less, on all the bands that I tuned up. And looking forward to having this option now to run a full 100 watts when I'm using random wires like the Rybakov or a 9 to 1. Um, before, I had to put the ICOM 7300 into emergency mode, and that limits power to 50 watts. That's more than enough, honestly, for portable operations like POTA, but it's nice to have that operation or option to uh, be able to run more power, but also be able to try a lot of different antenna combinations and not have to worry about putting the ICOM into emergency mode. I'm looking forward to using the tuner more and uh, looking forward to doing the Rybakov more. I haven't set that up in a while. It's going to be a nice option to have as we start to go into the winter here in upstate New York. It's always nice having a multi-band option for POTA where you don't have to get out of the car in the snow to change bands. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't yet, click like, subscribe to my channel. If you got a question, leave it down below. I'm Mike, N2MAK73.